Hey yo, I'm Alex, I'm a Night Digi Destined, and I have achieved dizzying new highs of comfort. Look at this, look at this thing, it's massive. I feel like I could jump off a building and it would just fly and glide me gently down to the surface below and took me into a deep slumber. Purchase of the century, look at it. Amazing. Expect me to be wearing this in every video ever. So good. So before you do anything, before you buy any more Digimon stuff, before you do any of your grocery shopping, before you pay any of your bills, get one of these things. It has transformed my life. I'm a new man. <laughs> anyway, the real reason we're here is to look at some fancy cardboard. Da Digimon Double Diamond. This is BT6 of the Digimon card game, and I'm very excited to be looking at some new cards. And this time around, we can see the poster boys are Agumon Bond of Courage and Gabumon Bond of Friendship. And this leads me nicely onto my first rant of the video. Bandai's glorious dubbing team have made a monumental error. They have dubbed Agumon Bond of Courage as Agumon Bond of Bravery, which is stupid. It is completely wrong. Yes, bravery and courage mean the same thing, but Ty's Crest is not the Crest of Bravery, it's the Crest of Courage. Anyone that has ever watched a single episode of Digimon knows that. <laughs> but yeah, let's not let it take away from the fact that we've got some epic mons on here. But Bond of Bravery, no, it's not going to fly. If they change Gabumon's friendship to maybe like Bond of being a good mate, then maybe, but no, they haven't. They've uh, clearly just have no idea what they're talking about. And it really winds me up because the card game really feels like it's made by genuine Digimon fans, and then it gets handed over to be translated into English and just shafted. <laughs> but yeah, enough of that. Let's open this up and let's look at some pretty pictures. So I have managed to open a few of these packs already, but because this is the first look on this channel, I will have a, a detailed look at most of the cards. So. Get yourself comfy, it's gonna be a long one. Right, here we go, watch the box topper. Dun, 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 dun. We've got Kiaramon. Cute little fox thing with cute little blob thing. Kinda cute. Uh, we've got Digimon card game, one year anniversary promo pack. And my amazing local game store included two dash packs. Buzzing, so we've got some nice goodies to open along the way. There it is, ladies and gentlemen, a full box, and we're going to steam through all of them. Prepare for some epic stuff. There we go. So the thing, the main thing that has got people talking in this set is the inclusion of a fancy new ghost rare. It's an alternate version of Omnimon from the original set, uh, and it's all white, and the rarity is absolutely ridiculous. I think it's like one per case, which is just absolutely mental. And yeah, it's currently selling for insane prices on eBay. So yeah. Pretty cool stuff. We've got Pagamon, the version 5 baby. Red Reamer, it's Bond of Courage's special attack. Look at them abs. He's not got a six pack, he's got an everything pack. <laughs> and Skull Greymon, sick. Perfect, perfect Digimon to kick off with because dead, dead, dead. Skull Greymon on the vital bracelet. I live for these reference shots. Look how nice that looks. And I've got to say, School Greymon Sprite on the Vital Bracelet is my favourite Vital Bracelet Sprite so far. All of them look amazing, but look at that. That is just perfect. Stomping around, absolute war machine. Bringer of death. Ace, next pack. Okay, we've got Gizamon, the version 5 rookie. Eosmon. Got some spiky boys giving Etamon a bit of a shock. It's basically Lego. <laughs> uh, we've got Shoutmon dropping in through the roof, ready to kick some ass. We've got Mistymon. I don't, I don't know, no comment. Uh, we've got Shamanmon. Now this, not Shamanmon, it's in English. I'm screwing it up already. We've got Goblimon. And uh, this looks like Great Canyon from Digimon World 1. Ace, Petaldramon. Really cool Digimon. Howling Memory Boost. So we've got Gabumon going Super Saiyan. We've got Fly Bullet, so this is BL Starmon's special attack, and for unknown reasons, she's been quite popular. Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> We've got Peterman, little baby kiwi thing looking adorable. We've got Pulsemon, the poster boy for the vital bracelet. And Ogremon, perfect. Now, I've seen this card already, but this is such an awesome card. This is one of my favorite cards from this set. So here we can see Ogremon with his Agumon henchman from Digimon World 1 outside of Ogre Fortress, chowing down on some of that delicious looking meat. What a dude. Ogremon is a Digimon that knows how to party, 100%. Okay, steaming through. We've got some Spiky Boys, Mistymon, Gizamon. 
Parabolic Junk. So this is Junkmon special attack and tribute to Mr. Matt 55. Junkmon is ya boy. Uh, Parasaurmon. He's a Parasaur. He's a Mon. He's Parasaurmon. Asuramon, Mr. Fist, Mr. Punchman, Punchy McFist. We've got Modiki Betamon, Mimicmon. Mimicmon's a really cool Digimon. He just looks so creepy. It's such a unique design. I don't think anything like this has existed in any other universe that I've ever seen anyway. It's just one cool looking thing. Next up, this is another amazing card. The art on this is such a brilliant tribute. So once again, Digimon World 1. So there is an age-old trick in Digimon World 1 where you can find Mojimon who trades items with you. And one of the items he trades, you give him an item that's not worth a lot and he trades it for an item that sells for a lot. So it's like a money trick where you go to him and you do like 100 trades of those and then you go and sell everything that he's just traded back and you make loads of money. And I'm willing to bet that this item is that particular item. Really cool. Demi Merrimon and Mokumon. Morphamon. Morphamon was a new Digimon introduced with Last Evolution Kizuna, and she's just a beautiful design. Look at that. Awesome. And there he is, Agumon Bond of Courage. Why does it say bravery? That is so annoying. They've really soiled what is such a cool Mon. Look at that. He is just absolutely stacked to the teeth. The dude is shredded. Brilliant. Brilliant. Judgment of the Blade. Big Mamemon. Chungus Mamemon. Look how big this big Mamemon is. It even says big on his boots. Got all them little mini Mamemon just chilling out, looking shocked at just how beefy this Mamemon really is. Chungus Mamemon. We've got Ferrismon. Completely new Digimon to me. I don't know if he is a new Digimon. It's just my first time seeing him. Gigadramon. Such a sick Digimon. So he's Megadramon's twin. He's like a slightly different color, but he has metal wings rather than tattered kind of fallen angel wings. Kind of cool. Skull Mammothmon having a bit of a wrestle with Skull Greymon. We've got Bakomon. Now this is really cute because obviously Bakomon's a box and you can see Nyaramon and Meikumon are enjoying themselves because everyone knows how much cats love boxes. Cool. Eosmon. We've got Mimicmon. We've got Abormon. Now he's from Digimon Frontier, but I don't have much to say because I've not finished that. I've only really scratched the surface of Frontier. But look closely and you will see Ned Flanders peeking around from the bushes. There he is. Look, look at that moustache. Looking great, Cherrymon. Looking great. We've got something German. This is uh, Gundramon Special Attack. Sistermon Seal. And Jessmon. Sick. Jessmon is probably my favourite Royal Knight, so I'm buzzing to have him. So cool. That's a pretty good look so far. But we need that Omnimon so I can quit my job. <laughs> we've got Deputymon. He's a gun wearing a hat. Don't mess with the gun wearing a hat. Uh, we've got Ginkakumon. Just some beefcake. We've got Deltamon, one of the version 5 bad boys. His um, sprite was based on King Ghidorah. Fun fact for you, there's Strabimon, Emo Boy, Edgelord, look at him, pouting under the moonlight. Looking sick. Eldradimon, School Mammothmon, Nannymon, he's finally made an appearance in the card game. It was only a matter of time, and here he is looking glorious. Gotta love the testicle with legs. Gotta love him. <laughs> We've got Pile Volcamon, uh, looks like he's having a bit of a rivalry with Metal Etamon. Uh, we've got Teropiamon, buzzing that Teropiamon's finally made an appearance as well. Hands down, one of my favourite Digimon ever. Next, Ornismon, and I've screwed it up. We've got Matt Ishida from Last Evolution Kazuna, and Hookmon, another annoying thing. So, he's known as Hackmon in the Japanese one, and even in Adventure Try, he calls himself Hackmon. However, when they did the English release of the Digimon 20ths, he was Hackmon, but the rest of his evolution line was Hookmon. So I was like, is it Hackmon or is it Hookmon? And now he's Hookmon. And it wouldn't bug me if they hadn't called him Hackmon in the English dub of Adventure Try. <sighs> they say knowledge is power, but I think knowledge is pain. I'd rather just not know these things and just live happily and unannoyed. <laughs> okay. Don't take life lessons from me. Uh, we've got Ginkakumon, Modiki Betamon. We've got Tinkermon. Never thought we'd see one Tinkermon card, but now we've got two. Uh, we've got Elecmon, the virus Elecmon, giving Gabamon a bit of a shock. We've got Teropiamon, special attack, tropical venom. 
Strabimon Emo Boy. We've got Tapiamon, and this is really, really nice artwork. Look at that. Baluchimon just looking over his shoulder. Just looks so beautiful. Peaceful. There's Agamon. Again, I think this is out of Last Evolution Kizuna. I think there's a big presence of that. This card is sick. This card is so cool. So here we've got Agumon and Black Agumon having a card battle with Volcanomon doing like the announcing. But this is also really cool because there's also that other card where it's War Greymon and Black War Greymon having a card battle. So I feel like this has been one long card battle. They've been sat there long enough for them both to become mega level. Really cool. Uh, next up, we've got Thick Boy Gabumon. He looks so snuggly. Look at him. He's wearing one of these things. That pelt, it's like one of these. Uh, next, we've got Matishida and Gabumon Bond of Friendship buzzing. So this is one that doesn't annoy me because Matt does have the crest of friendship. And that is so cool. Just looks really moody, really icy, really chilly. Sick. Sick. Let's do our anniversary promo pack. It's da -na 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 Millennium on sick man that is nice. I love that they've added textures to the shinies now. That looks so cool. What a creepy dude. There's just so much going on there. That is a level of detail that only Digimon dares to go to. So cool. Amazing. Absolutely love it. Buzz it. Oh, it's toasty in this thing. Look at it. It's like wearing a blanket. I feel like I could just lay down anywhere and get instantly comfortable. Mm. It always gets really hot when I film as well because I'm sat by this window and the sun beams through it and just bakes me. And I can't have the window open because I live on a really noisy estate. <sighs> First world problems. Right, let's rock. More packs. Let's rock. We've got Octomon. Looks like he's found his way into Hookmon's treasure trove. Hookmon does not look happy about that. We've got King Kakumon. This is a freaky looking thing to me. It's like a really muscly woman, but it looks like it has a man's head. I don't know. I don't know what to make of it. It's uh, a very weird looking Digimon. Uh, we've got Baluchimon. Um, once again, now we've got Tapiamon on Baluchimon's back. It's pretty cool. Forbidden Trident. That's Dragomon's special attack. Petaldramon. Murmuskmon. Another Digimon that I'm only just seeing now. Eosmon. Saviour Hookmon. Kiaramon, Junkmon, tribute to Mr. Matt55, Gundramon, buzzing, so he's one of the three musketeers, and look at him, he's just a gun dragon, that is so sick, there was that one episode of Pokemon that got banned because it had a gun in it, and then there's Digimon over here where it's like, yeah, let's just build a dragon out of revolvers, so sick, Digimon's just fearless, and I love it, and System on Blank, beautiful, okay, we've got Mermeskmon, Forbidden Trident, Deltamon, Reinforcing Memory Boost, Eldradimon, Panjamon, Kinkakumon, Demimerimon, and Mokumon, Teropiamon, Pile Volcamon, Red Reaper, and Cutting Edge. Cool. Flying through these packs. Let's do a dash pack. Dash pack. Do 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 do. Here we go. It's Curry Sarimon. Sick. That will go brilliantly in the Diaboromon deck because he has this cool thing that turns all the deep. Bleh, 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 bleh. He has this cool thing that turns all the Diaboromon tokens into blockers, which pretty much stop your opponent doing anything if played right, of course. If you've been here a while, you know that I'm a huge Max Mofo fanboy. So let's do a Max Mofo Mega Pack. So we keep the camera rolling. No cuts, no edits. We keep it rolling. We take that off. We put the rares here. We put the bulk there. Then we open the next one. And yeah, we're keeping the camera rolling. That comes off, rare, rare stack. And then third pack, here we go. Uh, we take this off, we go rare, rare stack. Okay, so we're gonna go through the rares first just in case I screw anything up and need to cut it. At least I won't have like messed up the rare pile. So here we go, let's have a look. We've got TK and Kari, again in the last Evolution Kazuna art style. Next up, we've got Raddle Star. So this is Gabamon Bond, the Friendship Special Attack. Next up, we've got Izzy and Joe. Next, we've got Entmon, one of my favorites. Such a cool dude, such a creepy looking rotten zombie tree type thing. Next up, we've got Wyvern's Breath. So this is Dinosmon Special Attack. 
Uh, we've got Rebellion. Rebellion had an ace episode in the reboot alongside Cute Mon, believe it or not. It was a really good episode. Cool, so those are the rares. So we've got uh, some cats enjoying some boxes. Giga Dramon, Memory Boost, Chungus. We've got Creepy Sea Dragon. We've got Devil Guy. We've got Pukumon. Pukumon's really cool because he's a Digimon inspired by the British punk scene, believe it or not. So he's a British punk puffer fish. Awesome. Uh, we've got Impmon. Love this. I absolutely love this card. You can see Kenji Watanabe's art style a mile off. I just feel like he has such a unique style. I feel like it stands out from all other artists. And yeah, you can guarantee that any card illustrated by Kenji Watanabe is going to be an ace one. For those of you that don't know, Kenji Watanabe is one of the original Digimon illustrators and widely considered as one of the many founding fathers of Digimon. He's such a cool dude. Next, Pagramon. Next, Deputymon. We've got Mammothmon. Really cute. We've got Frigimon and a little Yukimi Botamon. Uh, sea Dragon. We've got a Testicle. We've got Megadramon to go with our Gigadramon. One of the original Digimon, he's first appeared on the version 4 back in 1997, 1998, and he stood the test of time. He is still just as badass today as he has ever been. There aren't many Digimon that overshadow this geezer. Next up, we've got Boogiemon, we've got Parasaur, we've got Bibimon. I love this one as well, this is really cool. So this is the baby form of Pulsemon, who again debuted on the Vital Bracelet. And you can see here, he's actually on the Vital Bracelet screen, so you can see the steps just off the top, just like we can here. Really nice little detail. I love it. There's Mojimon, there's Impmon, Bulkmon looking shredded. Panjimon, this guy, this guy. Apemon, love it, absolutely love it. Tribute to Komon Kit, just surfing around on a cloud. I didn't even know Apemon could do that. Pretty cool. Megadramon, Tinkerbell, Sunamon, Agumon, Abormon. Cool. Before I continue, let's check in with our V pets. Today I have. My version 5 and I have raised Datamon. Datamon is an ultimate level Digimon and he's also known as Nanomon and he is so cool. So all the original versions 1 to 6 they had like they had three ultimates that appear on it. They did one like big badass one like Metal Greymon, they did a dot one like Mamemon and they did a trash one like Monzemon. And they all follow that same pattern. So on the version 5, the big badass one is Metal Tyranimon, the dot one is Datamon and the trash one is X Tyranimon. So yeah, this is my first date I'm on and I'm loving it. Let's check him out. Go! Look at that, firing bombs. He's buzzing. He's absolutely buzzing. Okay, pack time. Here we go. Back to the packs. Okay, we've got Toy Agamon, the clear one this time. We've got Mr. Punchman. We've got Mr. Shredded. Parabolic Junk. These guys look like they're planning some kind of prank on School Greymon. Probably not the Digimon you want to be messing around with, but whatever. It's your funeral, guys. We've got Barbamon. Look how cozy that is. Just knitting a scarf, little Bottomon chilling out next to her. She's enjoying life. We've got Kiaramon splashing in a river. We've got Junkmon enjoying some junk. We've got Izzy and Joe and secret rare Alphamon. Buzzing. I actually already have this, but I'm more than happy to have more of this thing. This is such a nice card. The texture on it is amazing. The art is awesome. He has really cool effects and overall he is just a legendary Digimon. He's mega, he's vaccine, he's a holy warrior, he's a royal knight and ex-antibody. Do not mess with this geezer. Sick. It's pack time. What do you reckon? Are we going to get that Ghost Rare Omnimon? I don't think so. <laughs> I couldn't even pull the Secret Rare Metal Greymon. Uh, but you never know. You never know. Uh, we got these guys. We've got Gundramon and Magna Kidmon. That's cool because, yeah, Gundramon's part of the three Musketeers, which are Gundramon, Magna Kidmon, and BL Starmon. So kind of cool that they're both in the same pack. Kind of cool. Okay, here we go. It's Octomon, Apemon, yeah. That's, again, a really nice reference to a really special episode in the original Adventure Season 1, uh, The Cave. At least that's the vibe I'm getting from it. The episode with Matt, Gabamon and The Cave is just a beautiful, beautiful episode. And I'm hoping that that's what this is tribute to. We've got Taikamiya and Manticormon. Digimon are great at doing these kind of paradox things. So Manticormon is like a holy Digimon, but he's also this savage beast thing. So is he 
a good Digimon that does evil things for good reasons, or is he an evil Digimon disguised as a good Digimon to do evil things? I don't know, but whatever it is, it is such a cool Digimon. Look at all them teeth. Freaky dude. Absolutely freaky dude. Love him. Time for Dash Pack! This is our final Dash Pack of the video. Really hope I can get this Gilmon. Just such a really nice looking card. Here we go. Come on, Gilmon, reveal yourself. It's Wizardmon. Okay, okay, I'm happy with that. That is a beautiful artwork. Okay, we've got Wizardmon, Ghostmon, walking through a spooky little village. That is so cool. Beautiful. No Gilmon this time, though. Okay, here we go. We've got Tropical Venom. We've got Delta Mon, Mermuskmon, Memory Boost. Feel like maybe we've already got all the commons because I'm not really seeing anything new. We've got Macmon. This is another really cool card because you can see Agamon having a race with him. And that's the same racing car that Agamon's in on the cover of the Digimon racing game for the Game Boy Advance. So again, a really obscure reference to a really obscure lesser known Digimon game. And there's just a Macmon racing him. Just doesn't have the same feel. You've got like cute little Agamon just being all cute and like being the mascot. And then there's Macmon, just this weird motorbike with spikes and teeth. Creepy stuff. And we've got the girls. What does parabolic mean? I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah. More of the same. Uh, Mojimon. Ornismon. Pinamon. Underworld's Call. This is cool. So this must be Titamon special attack. And there he is looking awesome. Cool. And a Zulongmon. Sick Digimon. He's one of the sovereigns and he's just amazing. He's basically a god dragon. He's got a big badass beard. He's made out of a storm. He's got chains. He's got a horn. The dude is a badass. Undeniably a badass. Okay, um, I want to ask you a question. I would like you to tell me your favourite card that has appeared so far in this card game. Uh, for artwork purposes, just your favourite card to look at, what you think is the best looking card that they've released so far. Mine's obviously that secret rare Metal Greymon. Oh, buzzing! Buzzing! <laughs> nice! This is the Alt Art Pulsemon. That's beautiful! That, whoa, I was not expecting that. That is so nice. Again, the texture, look at that, it's beautiful. Looks like electricity, so much energy, it's so vibrant, that is beautiful. Whoa, wait a minute, is that the weird sloth thing? That's the weird sloth thing, Namakemon or something like that. Okay, that's a cool card, that is a sick card. Proper buzzing with that. Uh, yeah, let me know your favorite card. So mine, yeah, is the Secret Rare Metal Greymon, and I'd just really like to know what your favorite artwork is. And then if you're playing the game, let me know what your favorite card is for like effect purposes. You know, there's some cards just have fun effects to do. I love Nidhogmon, the way it digivolves and just wipes the field. I think it's really cool. Uh, yeah, Blaster Disaster, Barbamon, Fly Bullet, TK, Iron Fisted Onslaught. Another effect I really like, I know it's basic and it's from like the beginning of the game, but there's that War Greymon build in black where it's like Toy Agamon, Greymon, Metal Greymon, War Greymon ends up just being a really strong Digimon. Just like basic strong, I mean, it probably doesn't stand any any chance in the meta format, but I just think it's a really fun build. Yeah. Mamemon. There's an alt art of this Mamemon that I really, really want. I think it's probably the nicest looking card in this set. It's just, again, so colorful, and it's got all the Mamemon forms in it. It's just an amazing card. Okay, uh, yeah, more Digimon, more digital monsters. Hookmon. And it annoys me that he's called Hookmon. <sighs> okay, we're down to the last two packs. 
Last two packs, here we go. Come on, Omnimon, give me that ghost rare. Let me quit my job for a month. <laughs> okay, what do we got? What are we working with? It's Hookmon again. He's just taking the mick now. And Dinosmon, sick, another one of the Royal Knights. Another really cool artwork. That is a dude, isn't it? Look at him. Final pack. What's it going to be? Here we go. It's Chungus. We've got Bulkmon. We've got Megadramon. We've got Virus Elecmon. Tropical Venom. Forbidden Trident. Gli what does Glive mean? Why can't they just call it purple? Come on, I'm a simpleton. Uh, Demi Merrimon. Blasted Disaster. Something German. Matt Ishida. And Manoa Beluki. Yeah. Not such an explosive last pack, but overall... That box has been ace. Thoroughly enjoyed. So yeah, that's that. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe, stay ace, keep rocking. Peace. And get yourself one of these. Look how comfy it is. It goes down to my knees. Look, look at that. Dun, 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 dun.